China's first batch of female heavy fighter pilots is ready for combat missions. The five female cadets of the J-11B fighter successfully completed their solo flight, which also marks that they have become qualified female pilots of the heavy fighter. Based on the introduction of Russia's Su-27 fighter jet, the J-11B has been fully domesticated and greatly upgraded, making it one of the world's first third-generation heavy fighter jets. With an empty weight of 16 tons and a takeoff weight of about 24 tons, it can reach a maximum speed of Mach 2. 35. The average age of the five female cadets on their first flight was just 23. After several rounds of selection, they realized their dream of becoming China's main fighter pilots, the report said. China's first five female J-11B fighter cadets, directly trained by flight schools, recently underwent solo flight tests at a brigade of Zion Flight Academy of the Air Force. Solo flight, in fact, refers to the independent pilot aircraft to complete the training course. In the examination, the five female pilot cadets have completed the general pilot technology training, which has taken an important step towards becoming a qualified third-generation fighter. One of the female cadets said that the first solo flight involves more maneuvers, including advanced maneuvers with large loads, such as turning to maintain energy and circling at maximum angular speed. The comparison tests our ability to master the boundary performance of the aircraft and the precision control of the aircraft. Flight instructors at Zion Flight Academy of the Air Force said five female cadets flew solo for the first time and received excellent reviews. They have completed the J-11BS high overload and high intensity flight training, and their flight intensity is the same as that of male pilots. This is our chance to show that women can control this heavy fighter jet, said another female pilot. Women can fly the J-11B, and women can fly the J-20 in the future. As the first female J-11B pilots, these pilots felt both an honor and a test. Women are objectively less powerful than men, but flying fighter jets is not just about arm wrestling in the air. All the female pilots have reached the anti-load requirements of the pass line, and the mission is more focused on decision-making ability and flexibility level. Also, women have more endurance and tolerance than men. This is something women can better adapt to in the coming long endurance combat. The commander of Zion Flight Academy of the Air Force said that in future operations, more attention will be paid to the accurate control of weapon platforms and the meticulous, meticulous and sensitive characteristics of female pilots will give them greater advantages in weapon control, precision equipment used in terrain recognition, and enable them to complete combat missions calmly and methodically. Thank you for watching, please subscribe, like, share and comment.